Is Brooklyn still interested, or were they ever interested, in Harden? And it looks like they're trying to put out fires because, you know, there's players that are important to them that are would be part of that deal. Do you think that deal still has a possibility of happening? Yeah, I think Brooklyn had interest at the right price when a player like James Harden may be available and you know he'd like to come play for you. You've got to see what the price would be. And then you decide, is that price something we're willing to pay? Uh, what I don't think Brooklyn's interested in doing for anybody is – trading multiple picks out for years and years in the future, like the Nets did in the Kevin Garnett, Paul Pierce trade that dug them a very big hole. Now Harden's at a different point in his career, um, a different player than, than the previous regime was trading for with, you know, Garnett and Pierce who were more at the end of their careers. But you know, I think for the Nets, uh, they've got a good, some very good complimentary pieces around Kevin uh, around uh, Kevin Durant, Kyrie Irving, and listen, if a player like a Bradley Beal becomes available or a James Harden, like they're, they have the assets to get involved. Now, the one thing Houston has wanted in any deal for Harden is a great young player, multiple picks. Brooklyn's got very good young players. Karis LeVert's a very good young player, uh, borderline all-star in the East. But do they have, you know, a... Do they have that one knockout player that you say, okay, we can hang our hat on this guy in a James Harden trade? That remains to be seen. But right now, Houston Houston has not been interested. in engage, they, they showed very little, if any, interest in engaging Brooklyn in trade talks. As far as I know, they haven't talked in since the very beginning of, I mean, I guess it was last month. And so I uh, think Brooklyn right now is pretty focused on starting their season with the group they have and building some chemistry and, and getting off to a good start. And, and who knows what happens later in the year? Who knows what's going to happen with Bradley Beal moving forward? But uh, I think Brooklyn is going to be an attractive place for players to want to land. And, uh, you know, they've got to stay on the lookout, and they do have the assets to potentially get involved with a big player.